Hello everyone, my name is Sheikh Muhammad Tariq. Today I am going to explain about IMDb movie analysis. This is my final project, phase 1. In this project, we can see our agenda, project description, approach, tech use, insights and results. The project description is about IMDb movie dataset. We will frame some questions and find and try to find answer to it. We will clean the data and remove errors blanks to increase data quality. We will solve some tasks like finding best movies, directors, etc. We have six tasks here. Now approach. First, my first step is I will import CSV file into MS Excel file and convert it into table to ranges. Now I will frame some questions like what is the impact of the problem on stakeholders? What is the impact of the problem not being solved? Like this, I will frame some questions and I will try to find answer to it. Now, I will use Excel functions like count blank, sum, count if, like this to solve my task. I will use pivot tables also to solve my task. Here, we are going to use Microsoft Excel uh, version 2019 because Microsoft Excel is powerful to uh, powerful software to in data analysis. We can use other to other software like Python and SQL also, but Microsoft Excel will be more convenient for us. Here, there are insights. In this project, we can observe type of observation. Each task has different observations. The very first task is to clean the data. For cleaning data, now. I will open an excel file first of all I will import my data by using simple steps here you can see our data is imported but it, but it is in the form of tables I will convert into ranges Now we can see it is converted into ranges. Now I remove duplicates. I will remove duplicates. Now we can see 45 duplicates are present. It is removed and 4998 unique values are there. It means 5044 rows are present before cleaning. Now the next step is to clear blank spaces. To clear blank spaces, uh, first of all, I will select all blank spaces at once. So, for this step, I'm going to home, home page and find and select. So, first of all, we have to select all data and find and select. Go to special. Now, I will select blanks. <coughs> now, click OK. This you can see this select this cell is selected. If you do anything to this cell means these all cells are affected. So I will remove this cell means this, L, this blank spells are also removed. So I am removing now this one. Okay, you can see here blank cells are really, uh, removed. Now, even though if we clean this one clean this one blank spaces there are some blank spaces so to find that blank spaces we use sort option for example we are selecting v column and i am going to sort this one from small to large and the there are some blank spaces here so i will select all the thing to here now will do same process delete and rows like this we have to do for each and every column then we can do deep cleaning after cleaning my data the data looks like this one you can see here 3724 rows are present now before that 5044 rows are present you can observe the graph here and 45 duplicates are found so my first task is completed
now next task is to find the highest profit movies now to find highest profit movies i will create a new column called profit yeah you can see here already i created a profit column so i will remove i will first first of all i will delete this one now i will create new profit one and my formula will be to find profit we have to do difference between gross minus budget our gross is present in i column and budget is present in w column so i will do difference now w equal to and to minus w to yeah you can see the value is same here no track to up to 3724 Here. Now, now copy this profit table and movie title and budget into new Excel file. Uh, like I am copying now. I have already copied here. You can see here. This is profit, budget, and movie title. This is already sorted one. Means larger to smaller. Uh, now I will do graph between profit and budget. For this, I will go to insert, and I will do bar graph. You can use multiple graphs, but I am now using bar graph. Now uh, you can see the highest profitable movies is Avatar, Jurassic World, Titanic, and so on. Here I provided a list. You can see here, highest profit movies by observing this data uh, with low budget and highest profit, like not highest profit means with uh, with low budget and some profit. Uh, the movies, low budget movies, Star Wars Episode Four. Now this task also completed. This is my second task, and now my third task is to find. Top two fifty IMDb movies, IMDb rating movies. So for this task, there are two conditions are there. The first condition is the movie should have highest IMDb rating, and uh, it should not have less than twenty five thousand votes in the number of voted users column. So I am going to filter now by using sort technique. In this sheet, copy all the things. Copy and paste in new sheet. Now you can sort our number of voted users. Sort Z to A, larger to smaller. Here you can observe up to two thousand six hundred. The votes are greater than twenty five thousand, but below two thousand six hundred and one, uh, less than twenty five thousand. So we don't want this data. So I am removing. I am deleting the data. Delete. Let this one also. Delete. Now, copy this one. I'm DV rating and number of voted users. Copy this one. And the movie title also 
And I am debating also. You can use some technique to find highest rated movie. Larger to small. The highest rated movie is here. And you can select top 250 movies. I already provided a list here of top 250 movies and here you can see top 250 movies and uh, to find top foreign language movies we have to remove English movies here for this, for this one this one same repeat the process sheet 2 and uh, copy this sheet into new file new sheet copy this one no filter language use out option it will set we don't want English movies so we have to remove all English movie columns Here we are removing ended rows. Now we have to copy this one and copy into new sheet and I am deviating and move it at also. movie title and I am rewriting here yeah. now you can use our technique to find off foreign movies larger to smaller here you can see uh, the top foreign movies I already provided a list here are uh, the top movies the god the, the good the bad and the gay and this task is completed the very next task is to find best directors for finding best directors we have to find average of IMDb score and uh, for this this one we have to convert sheet 2 into pivot tables means our cleaned data into pivot tables this is already sheet 2 and i am converting Do pivot tables first of all. I have to select all select all no insert pivot tables. We have to 
director name select director name and next we have to select IMDB rating we want average not sum so we have to do we have to change the option of average use sort option to find best directors yeah you can see the top best directors here you can sort by name also by name or select top 10 and sort by name and give the ranking i already provided a list here one two three four five seven the best director is akira and the 10th uh, director top 10 directors is 10th place is richard and now we have to do for this one also foreign language directors also for this one select director name here this is already sort, sorted sorted one in previous sheet so we have to sort this one for our correct calculation director name here copy this column and paste here and convert convert this table into private then our analysis will be more easy select IMDB score and uh, director name and language also language here and we can we want average so we, I am changing to average here the changing option here now you can use sort option to find top foreign language based directors sort and set to smallest here you can see top average of top directors here you can sort by name I, saw, I already sorted by name so our uh, next task is completed here here next task is the, to find popular journals same thing we have to do we have to go to private tables like I have already private tables here this one we have to deselect this director and IMDB and DB score and we have to select genus okay we have to select two times here because to find how many count here the count is there so I am sorting here larger to smaller here you can observe that the comedy drama romance is the top uh, genre here this top genres and uh, I'll provide a list here in the PPT so uh, this task is completed here you can see the rank and uh, now the last task is about uh, creating new columns of uh, actors uh, for this task we have to go to sheet 2 and create a new sheet or otherwise before that we can use this sheet also like I am now showing uh, each and every graph because you can go to here and select the uh, graph here um, 
so i am selecting actor one name we have to select actor one name over here and movie title because the new columns will contain movie titles yeah. movie titles and uh, the very first name is merely Mer strip so we have to or bond pit also there here with the bond pit is there select these movies and uh, copy into new column here I already copied here in this sheet in this sheet I created a new column mainly strip Leonard and uh, combine uh, this one bar fit we have to combine this list by using concat show how I will show how it will it will work I will use concat function you can see combined column has some I will delete this one and again for better see just I am dragging this one that's all I'm dragging this is automatically filled because Here the formula is this one. This will concat these three columns and uh, will combine a column. And uh, for grouping, select after one name. select and go to the data go to insert group here group rows and grouping rows so my data is grouped now the task is I will convert this into power table so that I will uh, see my graph or uh, insert power tables bar bit count on the bar table. can see there are total 17 here so we do this one and this one uh, Bard Pit is 17 movies and Melly Strip is 11 and Leonardo DiCaprio is 20 movies Leonardo DiCaprio has highest movies we can see here graph we can see the graph here here we can see the graph now the next the next task is to find uh, critic favorite and audience favorite for critic favorite we have to find actor name and number of 
total name and average of number of critic reviews. So I am in this column name in this sheet. Sheet 43. I am searching number of critic favorite and actor name. Actor name is already selected. We have to remove movie title only. Now we can see we are we want average. We know already how to find average. Uh, this is the average. For finding favorite actors, we have to large to small. You can see Albert Finney has highest average of number of critic reviews, so he is the favorite actor of critic reviews. So he has 750. And uh, for finding uh, actor fav uh, audience favorite. We have to do average of uh, number of reviews, user number of average of number of user reviews. So I am doing that one. Deselect this one. Number of user for reviews, and we want average here. So I am doing average sort here larger to smaller. Here you can see Heather Donale is uh, audience favorite actor. When we want to compare only for three, these three columns means we have to select the three heroes like here. Here we can select sort here. After selecting uh, after uh, after analyzing we can see merely steep is uh, lowest and Leonardo DiCaprio has critic favorite and Bob Pitt is 245 with highest and uh, you can see Merle, again Le Leonardo DiCaprio is audience favorite in these three heroes this is comparison but when in total comparison the favorite actor is at the term of the audience favorite actor is and uh, change in number of votes over decades for this one uh, in the same pivot tables only we have to select title here and number of voted users and selecting title here and uh, sum of number of uh, users number of users number of voted users sorry voted users here and this this select this one and this select actor name also select actor name also so here 
here you can see the sum of the users now uh, you can uh, according to the guidelines or instructions in 1927 and 1929 comes under one section like 1920s and uh, do some so equal to do some here. 1930s nineteen thirty nine to do uh, some here the same process sum of from nineteen thirty three to up to nineteen thirty nine you have to do some like like this you have to do some I already did here and I provided list here and I'm copying this. here you can see here you can do it like this one select this one and see the graph here You can see here year by year year by year it's increasing but uh, in 2010 it it was decreased here you can observe uh, in 19 when compared to 1920 and 1930 it was increased but in 1940 there is downfall when compared to last decade like this in 2010 and 1940s like 2010s and 1940s there is slight uh, like not slight uh, there is downfall in number of voted users here this is our last task our last task is completed and uh, result in this project i have gained knowledge about imdb movie analysis like I have identified movies with highest profit and top 250 movies based on IMDb ratings the best directors with the highest mean IMDb scores I have also identified popular genres and analyzed the performance of specific actors uh, and observed the changes in the number of voted users over decades this analysis provides about MS Excel features and many techniques to solve the problems and thank you thank you all